US-based global private equity firm, Warburg Pincus has exited ad Indian multiplex giant PVR by selling its entire stake of 2.49% through its affiliate in a block deal recently. The transaction aggregated more than 380 crore rupees. However, major domestic mutual funds were among the top buyers of PVR in the open market. As per the block deal, on the BSE, Warburg-backed Berry Creek Investment sold 2,439,301 equity shares at a price of 1,559 rupees and 35 paise per share in PVR, aggregating to 380.37 crore rupees. This would be its entire stake of 2.49% in the Ajay Bijli-led company. Let's understand more about this transaction and how it might affect the market. While Berry Creek excited PVR, domestic mutual funds invested in the company. SBI Mutual Fund is the major buyer in PVR to 1,469,650 equity shares at 1,559 rupees and 35 paise apiece, aggregating to 229.17 crore rupees. Also, ICICI Prudential Mutual Fund picked up 641,300 equity shares at 1,559 rupees and 35 paise apiece, amounting to 100 crore rupees. French-based financial services company Société Générale also bought 328,351 equity shares in PVR through the block deal. On Monday, PVR share price closed at 1,546 rupees and 60 paise apiece, down by 1.81% on BSE. The company's market cap is nearly 15,150 crore rupees. Prabhudas Liladhar in its research report dated March 15 retained its buy recommendation on PVR. Jinesh Joshi, research analyst at Prabhudas Liladhar in the report, said, We increase our pre and ASE BITD estimates for a merged entity by 7.0% to 7.5% for FY24 to FY25. As we expect synergy benefits of tilde 2 billion rupees to accrue over next two years. According to Joshi, the PVR Inox merger is expected to firstly lend invincible size advantage to a combined entity, 18% to 30% screen, BO share respectively, secondly, enhance BS strength, Inox had net cash BS as of Jan end, enabling rapid expansion into new markets, thirdly, improve bargaining power with various stakeholders in the value chain like film distributors, real estate developers, ad networks and ticket aggregators resulting in material revenue, cost synergies. Joshi's note added, though there are concerns over Bollywood underperformance, we believe it is not a structural issue, but a problem of content, as OTT proliferation has raised the bar of audience expectations from the big screen. Lastly, Joshi's note said on PVR, to retain, buy, on the stock with a TP of 2096 rupees after assigning EV, EBITDA multiple of 15.5x to the merged entity.